Hello, it's your girl Suzette with Crafting with Suzy coming to you today with another unboxing. Um, as you can see, this is already out of the box for a specific reason. This is another DIY moon shop. So I did the unboxing previously with Queen and Queen is by Anna Dittman. So that's why this is already out. So if this is your first time stopping by my channel, thank you so very much. If you like what you see, please hit the like button, subscribe, leave me a comment, and don't forget to hit that notification bell. Um, you will then be notified of the next time I do my uploads here on YouTube. And I also have notification updates on my Instagram page where I will list below. Also, if you have been by to see me several times, thank you so much for your support. I enjoy reading your words of encouragement. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Alrighty guys, so let's get into this unboxing where I'm going to reveal to you the second diamond painting that I have from DIY Moon Shop. Um, if I didn't say in the previous video, I did order this at the end of April. Like literally, I believe it was the last day of April. And I did receive it on the 23rd of June. So it came in pretty good time, I thought. And also, if you've never ordered from them before, if you do, it is international shipping, but they do it by FedEx. So what happens with it being shipped by FedEx, you literally get it within a week. I don't even think it's a full seven days. So this painting here is a 60 by 60. And before I reveal it to you, I chose this one. I just kept looking at it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I just kept looking at it. I just thought it was so interesting. It just, I liked it, whatever. It don't matter. I liked it. And that's all that matters. So. This is Yolandi by Tanya Shatsiva. If I said that wrong, tell me. The artist is Tanya Shatsiva. And this is a 60 by 60 round. Yes, I love rounds. I am not partial to squares. I just love a good round diamond painting. So this is what I have to show you. Now, I don't wanna speculate, but I think she may be a witch. And that's only because of her eyes, but these mice in her hair, holding one in her hands, just the eyes. I was like, I have not seen anyone do this. I haven't seen this one unboxed. I'm getting this one. The tattoo on her arm, I bet you when that comes out, that is going to just look awesome. It looks like it's a face. So um, I probably will go over those, the outline of the face in dark ABs just so it can be really like popped out on her arm. And then the rats or the mice, their eyes. <laughs> Same thing because they're like red, maybe put one or two ABs and then the rest, the normal drills on there. But I like it. It's so different. I always do like bubblegum, cutesy, sweet, innocent type paintings. And I liked this one. You guys tell me, you know you won't hurt my feelings. Tell me your honest opinion. I know it's creepy, but it's creepy beautiful. It's creepy beautiful. I like it. The symbols are clear. I don't even have my light on underneath and I can see them very clearly just standing here. Um, I'm gonna show you guys the drill um, that I have. It looks like it's 45 colors. And 
Just in case you didn't see the kit previously, I'll just show you really quickly what the kit looks like. It just has, it has a few of these pins. It's a seven placer and a single placer. It comes like with three or four of those pins. It comes with enough wax. These four standard bolts. And then a pair of tweezers, which I normally never use. So I was sent, which is perfectly fine, one kit for both paintings. There was enough in there to do both paintings. So you don't need to send two separate kits. At least I don't think it was necessary. On the DIY Moon Shop, the schematic is not on the painting. It is a walking legend and I will show you what I mean. So let's just make sure this is really tacky. I'm gonna pull it up. And she is. And this is double-sided tape. I didn't need to roll this one backwards. Queen, I did. Queen, I did roll backwards. This one, it wasn't necessary. Um, listen, I don't care what y'all say. She is nice. <laughs> She's nice. I like it. I hope you guys can see all of them in her dreads, honey. So, now this one is different, which makes me wonder if this is an older kit because it does have the Ziploc bags for kitting up. This is the Walking Legend. It has the thumbnail, 45 colors. But these come in the bags that you have to cut open. And Queen had Ziploc bags. So you could just work out of the zip ziplock bags but these ones you have to cut open and then kit up either with the bags they provided with for you or in your kit so i'm just going to do a little asmr and i'm going to show you what the legend looks like It has the numbers and the symbols, and it also has the DMC codes on there. As I stated before, this is a round 45 colors, 60 by 60. And then if you can see better, the thumbnail. That is what she's going to look like. I'm going to insert a picture so you guys can get a really good look. Like, look how red her lips are. So you guys can get a really good look. Let me see here. D is 10. D is 321. Let me see if I can find the color that is on her lips. They do have a 666 in here. Ooh, this is 321. That's 321. And that is not what is in the rat's eyes. But I'm just gonna show you really quickly the colors. Here are the Ziploc bags here, and they come with little labels so you can label if you choose the kit up this way. And I actually am going to leave these ones in here. Oh, don't hate me. I usually show you guys all the colors. These bags are so tiny. There are a bunch of pastels. I'm gonna pull some out. There are no ABs. The ABs do have to be purchased separately. But there are a lot of pastels that are actually really pretty in here. 
So I'll show you a couple. Alrighty, and like here's some pinks. They're really pretty colors, some purples. So I think I'm gonna enjoy that part. Um, all the pretty colors. It's not just grays and blues. Let me see if I, um, here's a nice blue one. So this one is Yolandi. I think she is absolutely gorgeous. If you guys have not been on the website for DIY Moonshot, you should check them out. See if there's anything on there you like. They are licensed art that they have on their website. Sorry about the noise. It's licensed art. They are constantly getting new artists, always getting new artists. They do a fantastic job with that. Um, the paintings that they have on their page, I think there's something for everyone. I'm gonna take this down, I'm just gonna put it over here. They have something for everyone. There's a lot of diversity um, on their website. So you make sure you check out their artists. This one, no, it was female empowerment. I don't believe that one is on the website any longer. Double should be. So those previous two, I'll just put the pictures in so you guys can see them really quickly towards the end of the video. But um, I don't think female empowerment is listed anymore. If I'm wrong, don't have a problem with you correcting me in the comments. If you guys have any questions about this unboxing and about this painting, please leave me a comment below. Thank you all so very much for watching and remember to like, comment, and subscribe and always stay beautiful and stay blessed. Bye!